Hey guys, this is just going to be a quick tree ID video. I had saw a video from Craig over at Leaf Life Bushcraft. He's got a relatively new channel, pretty cool. He's doing some tree ID videos and bushcraft, uh, whittling spoons, camping related stuff. And I figured, uh, well he had done a video on the sycamore that grows over in the UK. And uh, apparently it's a completely different tree than the sycamore we have here in America. This is the American sycamore. And he wanted me to do a video response. So I figured I'd go ahead and do a video response and show our American sycamore for comparison. And as you can see, it gets to be a fairly large tree. But the main difference between this one and the one he showed over there in the UK is the bark. Because on our sycamore, the bark has a almost like a camouflaged appearance. Real flaky and lots of different colors from white, from white all the way to like a medium to dark brown. Here's a really young sycamore. You can kind of see that camouflaged, smooth, young bark. Give you an idea how big that is. And it'll peel off. growing right on this small low island right up from this lake that's, I think that's why they call it the plain tree because it grows in flood plains anywhere there's water seems to like and as the tree matures the bark changes and you'll find some really mature trees that don't have this appearance they'll still look relatively smooth like that up there and uh, more camouflaged looking kind of like a woodland camo but still even on this more mature bark it's real flaky and it flakes right off and if you look down at the ground you can see the uh, the bark flakes off and it's all over on the ground here around this tree and uh, I've heard some people refer to this as the big leaf maple because it gets a leaf that looks like a maple. Uh, I may actually be able to show you that. Yeah, right here. Even though it's the middle of winter, this is the leaf of the sycamore. A very large, as big as your hand or larger leaf that looks very much like a maple. Although this tree really isn't a maple. Maples have opposite branching. And this tree, hopefully you can see in the video, actually has alternate branching. Let's come down a little further right there. Now there's another unique feature to this tree, and it distinguishes it from other maples. And that's the seed. This tree gets a round pod with little spikes on it and I couldn't find any on the ground here so I'm assuming the animals eat them but I might be able to zoom in with this digital zoom and show you one that's still hanging if I zoom in too close it'll be too distorted but it should be right in the center of the screen there Here's what the seed of the sycamore, American sycamore, looks like. It's just a round ball, kind of spiky, warty. Almost like, almost looks like a an Osage orange, and it crumbles up. And there's all the seeds inside, a bunch of small fibers.
I'm not really sure what the seed is. Maybe it's the central portion. This is the first time I've ever really paid attention to the American sycamore to see what the seeds look like. It's definitely not like a maple seed though, even though it has a what looks like a maple leaf. Completely different tree. I'll do a little zoom on the bark up tops so you can get a closer look at that. I said this digital zoom isn't the best. I'm just zooming about halfway. Maybe it'll be a little less pixelated. But the reason I compared this to the maple is for one, because of that leaf. And for two, because you can actually tap this tree just like maple and get maple syrup, even though it's really not even in the maple family. It's a completely different uh, genus and species. Uh, a completely different family of trees even. But this is the plane tree family. And uh, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show that. I thought it was kind of interesting. This is one of those deals where common names uh, can get a little bit of skew. I mean this tree has a lot of different common names and compared to the sycamore over in the UK it's actually a completely different tree so I thought it would be neat to show it and uh, mainly just wanted to do this for Craig because he asked me to go ahead and do a video response and show our American sycamore and uh, that's how you identify it and if you guys want you know go check Craig's channel out I just subscribed to him fairly recently. I think he started his channel back in November. I believe he's a tree surgeon by trade, I think he said. And uh, he just does some some nice videos and you know he doesn't claim to be an expert or anything so he just seems like a decent guy. I really don't know him very well other than seeing a couple of his videos. But uh, if you like go check him out and also you know get out in the woods and see if you can find any American sycamores growing where you live. This tree likes to grow down where it's wet. That's where I find it growing, in wet areas, low areas. Anyway, thanks for watching, and thanks for all the comments and support.